So many people live in unhappy circumstances, but they make no effort to change their situation because they are conditioned to a life of security and conformity. But nothing is more dangerous to a man or a woman than a secure future. It breeds complacency, and complacency is a contagious virus. It festers and builds until every moment of life is filled with excuses of why things aren't how they should be. You see, no one's moved the cheese out of reach. People have just become content with eating the crumbs the relocation of it has left behind. Chosen to take off the gloves and tap out. To breathe the air of mediocrity. Recently, previous CEOs of major corporations were interviewed on their deathbed. And they were asked if they would change anything, if they could do it all over again. You know their answer? To make the same mistakes, only quicker. You see, it's time to start living, to try new things, to make new mistakes, then make more mistakes. Live and learn. You smell that? That's air. And that sound? That's the beat of your heart. And what about that moment? Yeah, that one. It just passed and you won't see it again. Because like complacency, inspiration is contagious too. If you are looking around and no one is inspiring you, then you need to be the one to inspire. It's time to fire yourself and hire a new you. The you willing to fight for greatness, to make a difference. I'm talking about a movement strong enough to write down in a book and look back on years from now. When your hair is turning gray and your skin begins to wrinkle, you can open this page and smile and say, now that's greatness. The point is, complacency lives in those not willing to make a difference. Create a moment, be the hand that writes in the book that needs no eraser. This is more than a job, more than a career. This is your experience of life right now, an interaction. Whether temporary or permanent, make 100% look easy today. Inspire someone.